Hey friends, so this is what happens when uh, you use a carbon fiber barrel at 600-ish uh, PSI. Um, yeah, so this is the old barrel. And as you can see, I'll bring it up here for a little closer inspection. It uh, exploded on me last night. Uh, I was shooting some stuff. Um, look at how frayed it is, just crazy. Um, hope you can hear that too. It's It just splintered completely. Uh, shot a piece off of it as well. Um, but like I was saying, I was shooting last night at 600 PSI. Um, I shot a, a bunch of uh, airsoft BBs out of it into a piece of wood uh, and it did surprisingly well in my opinion. Um, I don't really have any uh, previous airsoft experience um, but it seemed very powerful to me. Uh, I'll have a video of that later, uh, just the BBs in the wood. I'll show you. Like I said, I wasn't filming this at the time. But anyway, was shooting a bunch of BBs out. Everything was going great. It was at about 600 PSI, shooting stuff out. Um, I decided, hey, you know what, whatever. We'll shoot that <clears throat> crappy busted arrow off it a couple times. Did that. Uh, did it once. Went great. Um, the second time I fired, there was a, an extremely loud bang. Uh, the arrow was stuck in the target. Uh, and it took me, it, it, you know, the, the gun fires so fast, it took me a couple seconds to figure out what had actually happened. And yeah, this, uh, the barrel had flown off completely uh, and exploded at the same time. This piece, uh, the small piece that actually flew off it, uh, hit my thumb. Uh, didn't really do too much damage. It hurt pretty good. But um, yeah, so there you have it. Don't use carbon fiber, I guess, if you're... Uh, using high pressure. I would have thought it would have held up a little bit better, but uh, I guess, you know, the way these are designed are for uh, frontal impact and not, you know, pressure <clears throat> from the inside out. Get out of here, you little dingus. Uh, but, yeah, so just a, just a public warning. PSA, um, don't use carbon fiber. I'll be switching to brass at some point. Um, I have a, a brass uh, piece in mind that I think will will be perfect and should be able to handle the pressure uh, substantially better. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be making another video um, probably tomorrow or the next day um, of uh, another little setup I kind of threw together. Um, so stay tuned for that. And I uh, hope you enjoyed this. Like, comment, subscribe if you want. And uh, questions, comments are always uh, appreciated. And uh, we'll talk to you later. Hope you guys are having a good one. Take care.